Good morning, let me present you the headline of United Kingdom. Shinzo Abe, gunman admits shooting dead former Japanese Prime Minister police say. A man has admitted assassinating the former Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, police have said. Mr. Abe 67 was shot twice from behind while giving a speech at a campaigning rally in the western city of Nara. He bled to death after settling two deep neck wounds that damaged an artery. It is the first assassination of the sitting or former Japanese Prime Minister since 1930s. Prince Pincher, councillor told to hold group allegation. A councillor who said he was grouped by former Deputy Chief Whip Chris Pincher said he was told by colleagues to drop off his talking about it, about inter interaction from Conservative headquarters. Daniel Cook said Mr. Pincher MP for Tunworth's Trump Fish Fire grouped him into five and two six, which, which BBC standard he denies. Mr. Cook said the instruction led him to speak out about what happened. Lyrov walks out of G20 talks after denying Russia is causing food crisis. The Russian foreign minister left the G20 meeting of leading economics early after telling his counterparts that Russia's invasion of Ukraine was not responsible for global hunger crisis and that san sanction designed to isolate Russia mounted to the de declaration of war. The, the gathering on Friday was Sanjay Sarov first direct confederation with readers from the West since Russia mounted its attack on Ukraine. Elon Musk withdrew $44 billion bid to buy Twitter after weeks of high drama. Elon Musk has withdraw, withdrawn his $44 billion bid to buy Twitter after a dramatic few weeks, speculation and deal to, over the company was falling apart. Mr. Musk is terminating the major agreement because Twitter is an measured breach of the multiple provision of that agreement appears to have made false and misleading representation upon which Mr. Musk relied when entering into the major agreement. Hence, to resume supplies to Telsco after all overpriced prices. Lorries full of his product will be enrolled to Tesco on Saturday after the Kinchap baked beans and soap maker said it had reached a deal on prices increases with the UK biggest supermarket. Hence, it paused supplies to Tesco last week in dispute over, over cost price rises thought to be such as 30%, but new supplies are expected to arrive over the weekend. Please subscribe for more headlines like this. Thank you.